That's the play button. I imagine that that's the play button for the video, so. <laughs> Hello there, the internet. It's Connor Jones, back again. Hi, if you can tell, I'm a little, a little bit sick, kind of recovering from a cold here. So I'm a little nasally. Sure, that's annoying, so I'm sorry about that. There's nothing I can do about it right now. I am just drinking fluids and taking vitamins and uh, basically bathing in DayQuil and NyQuil and I'm sure you don't want to hear about me being sick. So what have I been doing? I've been editing all day because I just got back in town from going to Columbus, Ohio with my friends, The Orphan the Poet, and I watched them play a rock and roll gig. It's pretty cool. Yeah, got to got to watch them rock out and capture that with uh, my little, little doodad camera thing right here. And so I'm gonna show you some of that. So I hope you're ready, because uh, it's pretty cool. Hello, the internet. I am out here in Columbus with my friends in The Orphan the Poet. That's Ty right there. Oh God. Mm. Ah, it's good stuff, it's good stuff. Yeah, so you might notice I am in different clothes and the uh, lighting might be a little different and that's because uh, that's actually daylight uh, because last time it was like three in the morning when I was shooting this. Anyway, uh, after all that I took some of that footage and uh, I made some gifts out of it to give to the Orphan the Poet. Uh, not, not like presents, I mean I guess it is kind of like a present but it's like a, you know, it's not like in a, in a you know, box and it's not wrapped up or anything. It's a uh, it's a gif, you know, with no T, gif. Like an animated gif. You've been on the internet, you know what that means. Anyway, I wanna show you how to make those right now, if that's cool. You wanna, you wanna, you wanna do that? Great. Okay, so this should be a pretty quick tutorial here. Basically what I've done is I've already selected a little clip that I wanna use, uh, which I have this of, of Ty right here, just kinda going crazy with his guitar. I'm like, ooh, yeah, cool. All right, so easiest way to do this is if you have Premiere Pro and Photoshop, and uh, that's what I'll be using for this. Um, I just, you just take your clip, and then I already have my color grade on, my adjustments, whatever, and then I'm just gonna export it like I would like a regular video, but we don't really need the audio, so we can go ahead and uh, uncheck export audio. We'll save that, uh, as I already have it named here, but I'll go ahead and save it as gif underscore tutorial dot mp4. Export that little thing. Fast forward this, I guess. Uh, and presto changeo. It's done. All right, so now we can go ahead and grab the uh, the tutorial file there and throw it into Photoshop. Cool, so now we have this like funky new little timeline down here and if you're used to Photoshop, this is probably new because it's not normally there because it's not really like a, you know, a video program, but it'll load it in here and if you export it right now, Basically, it'll just kind of like freak out and be like, this is a very large file. And if you're trying to make this as a GIF, it's going to be kind of nuts. And the general rule of thumb you want to adhere to for Twitter is that uh, five megabytes is the maximum size. So what that means, you've got to kind of like reduce the image size. Um, and on a mobile phone, if you're, you know, like you're tweeting about something, it's not, it's not super noticeable. It's actually, it looks, looks fine. So we'll go ahead and I found, I already tested this one, so I know that the image resolution of this one should be 500 by 281. I'll go ahead and change that. And it'll ask you if you wanna convert it to a smart object, which, yeah, go, go for it. Cool, I'm gonna go ahead and give it a playthrough. Looks fine, I'm not missing anything. There's a little slow motion, bam! Cool, I will make sure to check uh, loop playback that way you know continues to play over and over and over again and then we just go up here to export save for web 
All right, and so we're just gonna tweak some settings to make sure that it stays under five megabytes so that we can upload it to Twitter successfully. I kinda of don't really wanna go lower than 64 colors, so I'll just adjust the dither. Just gonna like play around with it till you find something that fits. 275. Okay, cool, that looks like that's gonna work. So we'll save it right there. And you just save it as whatever you want. Uh, go ahead and click save, and when that's done, I'll go ahead and play it like a, like a regular old GIF. So, it's my gift to you. <laughs> yeah, I know, whatever. <laughs> anyway, um, if you like that, go ahead and click like down there. Maybe give me a subscribe, that would be awesome. And here's Ty to uh, send you off. All right, thanks for watching. Are you filming this? Uh-huh. I loaded on with no shirt, because I got my shirt dirty. Didn't want to continue that. I'm already staining this white shirt. And I put my shirt on, but now I have sunglasses on indoors. But that's because I forgot my glasses and I feel weird without something on my face and it helps me focus uh, more. Well, actually, I should put mine on. I, I know. Yeah, it is.